Hello again, brother. I'm going to read some of the Psalms. Listen close to this music playing in the background also. Psalm 68. Let God arise, let his enemies be scattered, let them. Let also them that hate him flee before him, so as smoke is driven away, so drive them away. As a wax melteth before the fire, so let the wicked perish in the presence of God. Let the righteous be glad, let them rejoice before God, yea, let them be exceedingly rejoice. Sing unto God, sing praises to his name, extol him. That rideth upon the heavens by his name, Yah, Yaboha, and rejoice before him. Say, Father of the fatherless, a judge of the widows, is God in his holy habitation. For God setteth the solitary of the families, he bringeth out those which are bound in chains, but the rebellious dwell in a dry land. O oh God, when thou wentest forth before thy people, when thou didst march through the wilderness, the earth shook, the heavens also dropped at the presence of God, even Sinai itself was moved at the presence of God, the God of Israel. Thou, O oh God, didst send a plentiful rain, whereby thou didst confirm thy inheritance when it was weary. Thy congregation and dwelt therein, O God, has prepared thy goodness for the poor. The Lord gave the word in great company. What great was the company of those that published it? Kings of armies did flee apace, and she that tarried at home divided the spoil. Though ye have lion among them, the pots ye shall be as the wings of a dove, covered with silver and her feathers of yellow gold. When the Almighty scattered the kings in it, it was white as the snow of Salman, as the hill of God is as the high hill of Bashan, and high hill as the hill of Bashan, to wide leap ye, you high hills, this is the hill which God desireth in to dwell in, yea, the Lord will dwell in it forever. So the chariots of God are twenty thousand, even thousands of angels, the Lord is among them, even as in Sineas in the holy place. So thou hast ascended on high and led captivity captive. Thou hast received gifts for men and the rebellious also, that the Lord God may dwell among them. Blessed be the Lord who hath daily loadeth us with benefits, even the God of our salvation. He that is our God is the God of salvation. And unto God the Lord belongeth issues from death. But God shall wound the head of his enemies, the hairy skull of such as one that goeth on still in his trespasses. And the Lord said, I will bring again from Bashan, I will bring my people again from the depths of the sea, that thy foot may be dipped in the blood of thine enemies, and thy tongue of the dogs in the same. They have seen thy goings, O God, even the goings of my God, my King, in the sanctuary. The singers went before the players on instruments, followed after among them with the damsels, playing with tendrils. Bless ye God and the congregations, even the Lord, from the fountain of Israel. For there is little Benjamin with their ruler, and the princes of Judah, and their council, and the princes of Zebulon, and the princes of Naphtali. Thy God hath commanded thy strength. Strengthen, O God, that which that was wrought for us. Because of thy temple at Jerusalem shall the kings bring presents to thee, and rebuke the company of spearmen, and the multitude of the bulls with the calves of the people, till every one submit himself with pieces of silver, and scatter thou the people that delight in war. And princes shall come out of Egypt, Ethiopia, Aya, shall soon stretch out her hand unto God. Sing unto God, ye kingdoms of the earth, sing praises unto the Lord, Selah, to him that rideth upon the heavens. 
Which were of old, though, he thus sent out his voice, that mighty voice. Ascribe ye strength to God, and his excellency is over Israel. And his strength is in the clouds. O God, thou art terrible in out of thy holy place. The God of Israel is he that giveth strength and power to his people. Blessed be God. Uh, Psalm 69. Save me, O God, for the waters have come into my soul. I sink in the deep mire, and there's no standing. I have come into the deep waters, where the floods overflow me. And I am weary of my crying, my throat is dry. My eyes fail while I wait for my God. And they that hate me without a cause are more than the hairs of mine head. They that would destroy me, being my enemies, wrongfully are mighty, they have restored that which I took not away. God, thou knowest my foolishness and my sins are not hid from thee. So let them that wait on thee, O Lord God of hosts, be ashamed. Let not them that wait on thee, O Lord God of hosts, be ashamed for my sake. Let not those that seek thee be confounded for my sake, O God of Israel. Because of for thy sake I have borne a reproach. Shame hath covered my face, and become a stranger unto my brethren, and, and an alien unto my mother's children. For the zeal of thine house hath eaten me up, and the reproaches of them that reproach thee have fallen upon me. So when I wept and chased them, my soul with fasting, that was to my reproach. And I made sackcloth my garment, and became a proverb to them. And they that sit, sit in the gate speak against me. I was a song of drunkards, but as for me, my prayer unto God is unto thee, O Lord, in the acceptable time. O God, in the multitude of thy mercy, hear me, in the truth of thy salvation, deliver me out of the mire. Let me not sink, let me not be delivered to them that hate me, and out of the deep waters. Let not the water flood overflow me, neither let a deep swallow me up, and nor the pit shut her mouth upon me. Hear me, O Lord, for thy loving kindness is good. Turn me according to the multitude of thy tender mercies, and hide not thy face from thy servant. If I am in trouble, hear me speedily. Draw nigh unto my soul and redeem it, because, because of my enemies thou hast known my reproach and my shame. And my dishonor and my adversaries are all before me. Before thee, reproach hath broken my heart, since so I am full of heaviness. I looked for some to take pity, there was none for comforters, but I found none. They gave me gall for my meat. Let the table become a snare before them. That which had have been further well for let it become a trap. Let their eyes be darkened, that they see not, let their loins continually shake. Pour out an indignation upon them, let thy wrathful anger take hold of them. Let their habitation be desolate, let none dwell in their tents. For they persecute him whom thou hast smitten, and they talk to the grief of those whom thou hast wounded. Add iniquity unto their iniquity, and let them not come unto thy righteousness. Let them be blotted out of the book of the living, and be not written with the righteous. As I am poor and sorrowful, let my salvation, O God, set me on high, and I will praise the name of God with a song and magnify him with thanksgiving. This soul so shall please the Lord better than an ox or bullock have that horns please. The humble shall see this and be glad, and your heart shall live for live that seek God. For the Lord heareth the poor and despiseth not his prisoners. Let the heaven and the heaven 
and earth praise in the seas and everything that moveth therein, for God will save Zion and build the cities of Judah that they may dwell there, have it in possession. The seed also of his servant shall inherit it, and that love his name shall dwell there. Psalm 70. Make haste, O God, to deliver me. Make haste to help me, O Lord. Let them be ashamed and confounded. Seek after my soul. Let them be turned backward and put to confusion at the fires my hurt. Let them be turned back for reward to their shame and say, Aha, aha. Let all those that seek thee rejoice and be glad in thee. As such as love thy salvation, say, Continue, let the Lord be magnified. But I am poor and, and needy. Make haste unto me, O God, thou art my help and my deliverer, O Lord, make no tarrying. Uh, Psalm 71. In thee, O Lord, do I put my trust. Let me never be put to confusion. Let me in thy righteousness cause me to escape, incline thine ear unto me, and save me. Be thou my strong habitation, whereunto I may continually resort, that thou hast given commandment to save me, for thou art my rock and a fortress. Deliver me, deliver me, O my God, out of the hand of the wicked, out of the hand of the unrighteous and cruel man. Thou art my hope, O Lord, thou art my trust for my youth. By thee I have held it up from the womb. I have been held it up from the womb. And thou art he that took me out of my mother's bowels. My praise shall be continually of thee. As a wanderer unto many, but thou art my strong refuge. Let my mouth be filled with thy praise and with thy honor all the day. Cast me not off in the time of old age. Forsake me not when my strength faileth. For mine enemies speak against me, and they that lay wait for my soul take counsel together, saying, God hath forsaken him, God persecute and take him, there is none to deliver him. God be not far from me, O oh, my God, make haste for my help. Let them be confounded and consumed that are my adversaries to my soul. Let them be covered with reproach and dishonor that seek my hurt. And I will hope continually, and I will praise thee more and more. And my mouth shall show forth thy righteousness and thy salvation all the day, for I know not the numbers thereof. For I know not the numbers thereof, and I will go in the strength of the Lord God, and I will make mention of thy righteousness, even of thine only. O God, thou hast held me from my youth. And hitherto have I declared thy wondrous works. Now I also, when I am old and gray-headed, O God, forsake me not, until I have shewed thy strength unto this generation, and thy power to everyone that is to come. Thy righteousness also, O God, is very high. Who hast done great things, O God, who is like unto thee? Thou which hast shewed me great and sore troubles shall quicken me again, and shall bring me up again from the depths of the earth. Thou shalt increase my greatness, and comfort me on every side, and I will praise thee with sultry, even thy truth, O my God, unto thee will I sing with the harp, O thou the Holy One of Israel. And my lips shall greatly rejoice when I sing to thee, and my soul which thou hast redeemed. And my tongue shall also walk, talk of thy righteousness all the day long, for they are confounded, for they are brought unto shame that seek my hurt. Psalm 72. I give the king thy judgments, O God, and thy righteousness to the king's son, that he shall judge. Judge the people with righteousness, and thy poor with judgment. The mountains shall bring peace to the people, and the, the little hills by righteousness. He shall judge 
the poor of the people, you shall save the children of the needy, and shall break in pieces the oppressor. They shall fear thee as long as the sun and moon endure. Throughout all generations he shall he shall come down like rain upon the moon grass, as showers that water the earth. In his days shall the righteous flourish in the abundance of peace so long as the moon endure. He shall dominion also from sea to sea, from the river unto the ends of the earth. They that dwell in the wilderness shall bow before him, and his enemies shall lick the dust. The kings of Tarshish and of the isles shall bring presents, the king of Sheba and of Seba shall offer gifts. They all kings shall fall down before him, all nations shall serve him. For he shall deliver the needy when he crieth, the poor also in him that hath no help him. He shall, he shall spare the poor and needy, and shall save the souls of the needy. He shall redeem their soul from deceit and violence, and precious shall their blood be in his sight. He shall live unto him, shall be given of the gold of Shabbat. A prayer also shall be made for him continually, and daily shall he be praised. And there shall be a handful of corn, and the earth upon the top of the mountain is the fruit thereof shall shake like Lebanon. They of the city shall flourish like grass of the earth. His name shall endure forever. His name shall be continued as long as the sun and men shall be blessed in him. All nations shall call him blessed. Blessed be the Lord God and the God of Israel who only doeth wondrous works, wondrous things. Blessed be his glorious name forever. And let the whole earth be filled with his glory, all men and men. Praise the day with the son of Jesse are ended. Alright, that's it of Psalms for now, brother. God well, bless you. A wonderful evening. Reka, Rabbi. Bye bye. Be greatly blessed. Bye bye.